We're told Gisela plots the ordered pair 4 comma 3 on a coordinate grid by moving 4 units to the right and 3 units down from the origin. Which statement is true? So pause this video and have a go at this before we do this together. All right, now before I even look at the choices, let's just think about how we would approach it if we had to graph 4 comma 3. So let me draw some coordinate axes here. So that is my y-axis. This right over here is my origin, and that is my x-axis. So if I had to graph 4 comma 3, the force coordinate is the x-coordinate, so it says how much to the right do we move in the x-direction? So I'm moving 4 from the origin to the right. So let's say that that is 4 right over there. Maybe that's 1, 2, 3, and then 4. So I'd move 4 to the right, and then the y coordinate right over here says, how much do I move up? So then I would move 3 up to get right over here. So maybe this is 3 right over here. This would be 1, 2, and 3 to go here. So I'd go 4 to the right, and then 3 up. Now it said that Gisela moved 4 units to the right, that's right, and 3 units down from the origin. So Gisela moved, did something like this, 4 to the right and then 3 units down and that does not make sense. So let's see, A says Gisela did both of them correctly. That's not right. Gisela plotted the X coordinate incorrectly and the Y coordinate correctly. No, it's the other way around. Gisela got the X coordinate right. They went to the right, but then should have gone, da should have gone up instead of down. So this one isn't right. Gisela plotted both the X and the Y coordinate incorrectly. That's not right. Gisela, she got the Y, the, sorry, she got the four part right. She got the X coordinate correct. And then process of elimination, but let's read this. Giselle plotted the x coordinate correctly. That's right. She did the 4 to the right. And the y coordinate incorrectly. Correct. She went down when she should have gone up. So I like this choice. Let's do another example. So here we are told that Lucia tries to graph the point 8, 2 on a coordinate grid. She starts at the origin, moves 8 units up, and then you moves 2 units to the right. So let me just think about how I would do that. So if that right over there is my x-axis, this is my y-axis, that's my origin right over there. And then let's see, if I had to deal with 8, 2, that first coordinate right over there, the 8 is the x-coordinate. It tells you how much to move to the right. So I would move 8 to the right, let's say right over here. 8 to the right, and then the second coordinate is the y. It tells you how much to move up, and then I would move 2 up. So I'd get to this point right over here. So this is 2. 8 to the right, and then 2 up. Lucia went 8 up and 2 to the right. So it looks like Lucia actually maybe confused the x and the y coordinates. So let's see, which mistake did Lucia make? Lucia moved 2 units right, instead of two units down. No, that makes, it should have been moved two units to the right instead of two units up. I'll rule that one out. Lucia moved eight units up instead of eight units to the right. That one looks right. So I like this one. I will save that one. Lucia moved two units to the right instead of two units to the left. No, this two right over here isn't talking about right or left. It's talking about how many units up. So rule that one out. Lucia moved eight units up instead of eight units now. No, it should have been eight units to the right, like we see in choice B. And we're done.